In this video, we will learn what cold and flu are, how long does it last, and how to treat with some home remedies. If you find this video useful, please like and subscribe. Difference between a cold and flu. Flu, influenza, and cold, both are respiratory diseases, but they are caused by different types of viruses. As both of these have almost similar symptoms, it may be difficult to differentiate between them. What is a cold? Colds impact both warm and cool temperatures equally, and the average person would have had many colds from childhood to later life. Symptoms include runny nose, watery eyes, sore throat, headache, and body aches, coughing and sneezing. Cold symptoms are usually milder than influenza, generally do not cause any severe health issues. There is no proper treatment except for resting and drinking plenty of fluids, but the cold normally passes within 7 to 10 days. What is flu? The influenza virus is of three types, influenza A, influenza B, and influenza C. The first two are those that cause seasonal epidemics. Some of the main signs of flu is feeling feverish or having a temperature of 100 degrees Fahrenheit or higher. Not everyone with the flu, though, will have a fever. Other symptoms include headaches or body aches, a sore throat and a cough, chills and shivering, a congested or runny nose, vomiting, nausea, possibly diarrhea, especially in children, fatigue. While the differences described above are generally true, without any specific testing, it is difficult to know for sure if it is flu or cold. Home Remedies The following are some home remedies that can help prevent illness, alleviate symptoms, and reduce the duration of a cold or flu and get you back to normal. Chicken Soup Chicken soup is a great pick for you while you're feeling sick. It can slow down the movement of neutrophils in the body to prevent your body from infection. When they move slowly, they stay concentrated in the areas that require healing the most. Ginger A few chunks of raw ginger in boiling water will help soothe cough or sore throat. Studies show that it can also reduce the symptoms of nausea that so often accompany influenza. Honey Honey has a wide variety of antimicrobial and antibacterial properties. Drinking honey and lemon tea will relieve sore throat pain. Research has found that honey is also an effective cough suppressant. Garlic Garlic contains the allicin compound that may have antimicrobial properties. Addition of a garlic supplement to your diet may reduce the intensity of cold. Echinacea Echinacea can reduce the risk of developing a common cold by over 50%. It can also reduce the duration of the cold. If you are a healthy adult, try taking 1-2 to two grams of echinacea root or herb as a tea. Vitamin C Vitamin C strengthens the immune system. Taking adequate vitamin C can help relieve upper respiratory tract infections and other diseases. Probiotics Probiotics are the friendly bacteria and yeasts. They can help in keeping your intestine and immune system healthy, and research shows that probiotics may also lessen your chance of becoming ill with upper respiratory infection. Salt water Gargling with salt water can help avoid upper respiratory infections as it reduces and loosens mucus which contains bacteria and some types of allergens. It may also reduce the intensity of cold. Vapor Rub Vapor Rub can reduce cold symptoms in children older than two years of age. Just apply once or twice before bed, and it will help open air passages to fight congestion, reduce coughing, and improve sleep. Reducing Stress and Sleeping Well Stress or inadequate sleep can increase the risk of catching a cold or a flu. One research indicates that reducing stress levels by mindfulness meditation or exercise decreases the risk of one of these diseases. If you find this video useful, please like and subscribe. Thank you.